guys. My mouth was just wide open from all these stupendous views. Check this out. I'm here in Utah with Venus, of course. And we are gonna hike an amazing canyon called Ashdown Gorge. There's gonna be waterfalls, there's gonna be water, we're gonna fall, we're gonna get wet. And it's gonna be crazy. So, uh, yeah. Stay tuned for that. All right, we came down to the creek here. Some kind of a dam here. All right, so we gotta cross the creek and you either go up and over or you cross this log. So I'm probably gonna cross the log here. I'll turn my camera off because I don't wanna fall. All right, I made my way across the log. Now it's Venus's turn. Yoga, yoga. Uh, I just ran across basically. You have to go fast, trust me. Venus. I knew you could do it. I didn't mean to push you, but I was like, God, you're more agile than me. You can probably do this. She does yoga all the time and... I just don't want to fall and get wet. So there is a bit of bush twack in here to do. We're just kind of following this trail up and around, I, I guess. Hopefully. It's a pretty faint trail. We're basically just hiking in bare feet now. I guess that's uh, how it goes. <laughs> it's good to have water shoes sometimes. Water hiking shoes. Yeah. I mean, this trail, you're supposed to be getting wet all the time. And that's what we're doing. So we made the decision that we're gonna put on our shoes and just go. We're just gonna get wet, because I think this trail is about 10 kilometers and we're probably like two kilometers in and it's we've already been here probably an hour, so we're not making up good time here. And, you know, not that it's imperative, but we wanna see the waterfall, we wanna see the arches and all the cool rock formations we see, so yeah, we better pick up the pace. We're coming into a narrowing of the canyon and yeah this is where the the real fun kicks in <laughs> this has been an adventure so far though holy moly it's cool very cool all right so we've managed to keep our shoes dry up to this point but uh we're trying to make up time, like I said earlier. I think we're just gonna get wet. I, I suggested we shimmy along here. Look at, people are doing it. I think it's wet footprints. Oh my goodness, really? Okay. All right, I made it up. I'm literally just hanging over this creek here. There's all these like handholds. You can tell people have been using this for a while. Venus is about to come up. 
and try her out too. A little bit sketchy. Are you sure? Here, I can come help you if I need to. You gonna make it? Here she comes, she made it. Hell yeah. All right, Venus has to jump. Come on. Yeah, you can do it. She's gonna leap across it. Oh yeah, see? Success. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> this hike tops them all, it's insane. These are the ones you'll remember forever. Oh, lucky. Well, we're officially soaked, but we lasted quite a while before we got wet, so. But we gotta make up time. We're just like wasting so much time thinking about where to step to try to get across this creek without getting wet. So, to hell with it. These cliffs are towering so high above us, it's crazy on all sides. So we've been going for four hours and we're almost at Rattlesnake Creek Waterfall. It doesn't generally take four hours, but we waited so long to get our feet wet. And now that we did, we're like, ah, we should have just done it. Then we would have been there sooner. Yeah, this is where they tell you there's a fork. See that, that hoodoo standing there? So you veer off to the left and that's where the waterfall is at apparently. We just passed a couple of people who said we were 30 minutes off, so. Oh yeah, I can see where the waterfall would be coming in. All right, we've headed off to the left, up this smaller canyon here. You can see a little stream coming down where the waterfall comes from. Well guys, we're actually getting fed up with how nice it is. It's actually getting kind of annoying. Every time I walk around the corner, we're like, oh my God, we have to film this. Like, look at this. We're in this giant crack here. It's taken us so long to hike this trail. It's supposed to be like, I think three hours round trip or four hours round trip, something like that. And uh, yeah, we're, we're pushing five hours already. But like we can't stop taking pictures obviously and getting videos because everything just looks sensational. But I'm sure it'll be ugly coming up soon. Then we don't have to take any pictures. All right, so we came to another fork and according to the map and those people we met up with, I think you go to the right here. And if you go this way, there's another waterfall, but it's a little bit further. So we're gonna head down to Rattlesnake Creek Falls. We can see it's getting more narrow, so I'm guessing we're getting closer to the falls. On the pictures, it looks like it's really like a tight little like slot canyon kind of thing. 
so we'll see. The canyon's really becoming quite narrow. Wow, it's lush. Oh, little cave thing. Another little cave. We can hear the falls now. It's got to be right around this corner. Really loud. What is it? A mouse? Yeah, it's in there. Is that underneath there? Oh, that's his little house. Aw. The mouse's house. All right, guys, we came, we saw the waterfall. We're just sitting here having a little rest at this uh, hoodoo here. And then we are gonna just trek back like as fast as we can, just whatever, without taking 700 pictures. I highly recommend Ashdown Gorge. It's pretty fantastic. Probably one of the best hikes we've done. Would you agree? Yes, I agree. Okay. We have a verdict. <laughs> Casey. Casey's insights. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> That's all you're going to get out of her, guys. Anyways, to it alls. <laughs> <laughs>